Yeah, these guys have been in classes, in rehearsals, creating these original pieces. All the things you see today were created almost solely by the students of these courses, okay? So all the stories, the characters, a lot of the lines, right, were created by the students themselves. And uh, like I said, I think you'll be thoroughly entertained by what you see. Without any further ado, enjoy the show. Mi? Mi? Sì, sì. Mi chiamo? Eh, 
mi chiamo ah, mi chiamo Elisabeth va bene what is your job? come si dice? lavoro ah, ho qualcosa per te
You are right. We must take our country back. But why do you send your men for the job? Because I'm not afraid to tell the truth. Because I will get things done. But become president yes, and then succeed. How are your company donations looking to that? Two friends. Could be better. <laughs> Yeah. Wow, man, that's a lot of zero. With this much money, I could take my message to all the people of this country. But why you do this for me? I don't understand. I know, good investment. Unless the one come with me, I'm wrong. You are going to need a better suit if you want to be president. to take your business somewhere else. It could be chaos. No, it must it not must be. Um, if uh, no, but we have only justice if everyone is our people. You're trying to solve all of our problems at once. I think it's impossible. It's not impossible. I years ago I was living on the street. Now I'm the president. I have enough food. Nothing is impossible. So come, but we have some work to do. Okay. 
So this next uh, TSP drama is all in French, okay? Put me in French. Uh, so some good things to do would be to listen carefully if you speak French or speak a little French, but also just to watch and see if you can follow the story as well. I speak zero French, but I'm able to follow this story pretty well, okay? There's some videos, some projection things to help you uh, follow along a little bit better, yeah? But just do your best to follow along. This is French drama directed by Miss Jamie Reimer and Miss Sandra Pisciano. Enjoy. Citoyen de Lips, c'est avec un immense plaisir que nous commençons l'année 1916, où le début de notre existence harmonieuse. Finalement, on a réussi d'éradiquer la distance de l'affection, de l'amour et toutes les émotions de notre société. Nous vivons dans la société idéale, une société de paix, ce crime, ce l'amour de joie et la douleur de l'amour et sa violence. Plus vite, nous avons vécu une année de paix et d'unanimité, notre chef n'a pas de content. Merci, chers commandants, pour votre effort et pour la création de changements récents. Aujourd'hui, nous sommes ici pour communiquer les nouveaux récords de nos nouvelles punitions. Les voici. Si un citoyen dérange le public parce qu'il montre de l'affection, de l'amour ou de l'ambition, il ou elle sera mis en prison pour le reste de sa vie. Et souvenez-vous qu'une société parfaite ou il n'a pas d'émotion est essentielle pour un monde après. Nous sommes maintenant la génération parfaite. Tu pourras être forcément puni. Je préfère vivre et souffrir que vivre une longue vie. Nous. Eh bien, j'ai la chance. N'oubliez pas, Marie. Vamos, calamos, calamos, calamos. Et j'ai fait tout. Peut-être que le commandant se trompe. Mais nous sommes la génération parfaite. Nous sommes la génération parfaite. Peut-être que c'est le moment de changer, de ramener les émotions dans notre monde. N'oubliez pas, Marie, l'amour est l'amour. C'est l'émotion la plus précieuse de toutes. Adieu. <rire> Je peur. Ressens-tu autre chose? Je, je me sens fâchée. Ils ont repris ma mère. Ressens-tu autre chose? Je crois que je ressens une émotion. C'est pour être médicale. Et voilà. Je vous vois et vous entends. Et je sais que vous jouez avec des émotions illégales. Mon cher François, on vient de découvrir une réalité extraordinaire. Il semble que tout peut changer. Vous devez nous rejoindre. Je suis obligé d'informer le chef de police de vos actions. Mais... Les règlements sont les règlements. Pourquoi? 
quais de que você é de tua. Jesus é obrigado a Suta los.
All right, as I was saying, the school will be hosting a Super Mario tournament and bake sale in the gym tomorrow. It is open to all students. A Super Mario tournament? A bake sale? What? The nerves are taking over the gym? What about basketball practice? <laughs> <laughs> I thought people stopped playing Mario when they were like 12 or something. Yeah, a Super Mario tournament? That sounds super lame. Girl! Super Mario is the greatest game of all Enter the tournament if you want, but please get to class on time from now on. Alright. Class dismissed. I guess. No, no, take the tunnel, you get a bonus. What? You play? I thought Super Mario was super lame. It is. I mean... Sure. I used to play with my big sister before she left for college. It was our favorite thing to do together. I've beaten the game a hundred times. Are you going to enter to the tournament? No way! My friends would make fun of me. They don't sound like very good friends. It's complicated. Well, listen, if you want to play, you should come to the audiovisual room after school today. We can help each other train for the tournament. That sounds awesome! Oh, but I promised Maria I will go to the mall with her today. It's up to you. See you later. <laughs> Oh, and Dave, where is Louisa? I think that I told her that we were leaving for the mall right after school today. Didn't I say that? I guess so. <laughs> I mean, she is so rude. I can't believe she will keep me, me, waiting like this. Can you believe it? No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, that's fine. I will wait five more minutes. I'm so done with this. Alright, let's go. No! Where are you going? We can't go without her. I need her to help me pick out a new pair of shoes. You are not going to help me with that either. What do I even end up with? Okay, not a chance. Okay, as I said, I will wait five more minutes. I'm done with this. Louisa, you made it. Yeah. This is Daisy. Hi, Louisa. And that's <laughs> Hey, what's going on? Do you guys hang out here every day? Yeah, the teacher lets us use it for about an hour after school every day. It's the only place where we can read our comics in peace. Hey, do you like comics? I can lend you a copy. Don't get him stuck. If he starts talking about Batman, you will never get him to stop. <laughs> He's the biggest nerd of us all. You bet I am. <laughs> I thought you didn't like when people call you nerds. Why not? Not just someone who really, really likes stuff. I am proud to be in this. <laughs> Check this out. What? I'm stuck on this level. What was that trick you were trying to throw? Oh, yes. So, you take the tunnel down to the cave. Then you collect all these coins and it spits you right at the end. How did I miss that? Hey, you are really good. If you enter the tournament, you would win for sure. You think so? Where is she? Oh my god! What? Louisa? Ew! Are you hanging out with these people? Hi, Maria! Hi! Hi! No, no, I got lost in the back. Sometimes you're like so stupid. Hey, I'm coming or not? We are waiting for 15 minutes! <laughs> One more minute? Alright, one more minute. Fine. So, we are working for 16 minutes! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know why they act like that. You really care what they think about you, don't 
don't you? I... You don't need to care so much. You can't just be yourself. I have to go. Have fun at the tournament. Okay, folks, take your seats. The first annual Super Mario tournament and bake sale is about to begin. Do you think she'll show up? I don't know. Maybe she doesn't want to change. <laughs> it's worth a shot. And now it's time for the main event. If all our competitors are ready, wait, wait. It seems we have a last minute entry. <gasps> Lisa, you actually came! Yeah, are you afraid of a little competition? Oh, it is on! <laughs> All our players are ready. Go! The player one is off to a good start, but the newcomer seems to know what she's doing. This is a close one, folks. Who will take home the prize? And the winner is... Luisa, coming out of nowhere to take the first place. I don't believe